With close to 400 lakes and over 880 square miles of water, Lake County is a fisherman's paradise. From the depths of Lake Superior, where the trout and salmon roam free, to the inland waters where walleye, bass, and pike thrive, Lake County is yours to explore. Good morning from beautiful, beautiful Lake County. What a gorgeous morning we have here. And today our plan is to chase after walleyes on Birch Lake. Now, this is a lake that has tremendous potential. There's so much structure here. There's so many walleyes. And what my favorite part is, is it truly feels like you're in the boundary waters, but you can use your boat. Like it's, it's true big wilderness. There's not a ton of cabins on here. It's like pine trees all throughout the lake. Like there's so much water to explore and it's kind of like a, a little hidden gem, so to say. And plus fishing can be very, very good. The walleyes in here are gorgeous, a little bit more bog stained water. You get those really pretty golden walleyes and uh, you can uh, actually have a, a really good day on here on, on Birch Lake. So we're gonna get this boat on plane and get to our first spot and hopefully see a walleye before too long. spot. So on Birch Lake here there's so much rock structure, so many rock piles, underwater rock points, um, and all those places are going to hold fish. And there's no one right way to catch them on this lake. It's fun. If you want to troll, you can troll. If you want to jig, you can jig. Lindy rig, you can lindy rig. Like you can truly fish however you want. So we're going to start off this morning with some jigs. We have light winds right now. They're going to increase throughout the day, but right now there's light winds. So we're going to pitch some jigs around, a jig in a plastic or a jig in a leech and uh, hopefully see a few walleyes. Kind of hopping a jig along bottom here and you wait till you feel a thunk. Right there, fish. Fish, 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 fish. A little walleye, but that's a way to start the morning right there. A little 10, 11 incher. There's definitely bigger and better potential down there, but that is a start. And that's what they look like up here in Lake County. We're gonna definitely see some bigger fish today, but that just tells you that you're in the right place doing the right things when you catch a walleye like that. We'll get that one back. And that's just on a little eighth ounce jig and we're tipping it with a leech. You can also use a plastic. Plastics work pretty well up here in May and June. And that's the first walleye of the morning. And hey, I, I'm looking forward to what the rest of the day has to bring because it is gorgeous up here. The sun is shining and there's walleyes below us. It doesn't get much better. All right, now that we have a little wind picking up in accordance with jigging, we can also use a slip bobber. Very, very productive way to uh, catch walleyes late June like this. And let's be honest, seeing a slip bobber go down is probably one of the most exciting things that you can experience fishing, especially when it's a walleye. So we're gonna toss out a couple slip bobbers and then from time to time, we're just gonna switch back and forth between the jig rods and slip bobber rods, depending on the type of structure that we're fishing. But again, as we referenced earlier, there's no one right way to catch walleyes. It's just uh, you do what you, whatever you want and whatever you prefer and seeing the slip bobber go down is pretty cool. Bobber down, bobber down. There it is. That's a fish. That's a better walleye. This is gonna be a better walleye on the slip bobber. Nice, look at this. Oh yeah, that's a good walleye. That there is a beautiful, look at that. That is some Northern Minnesota Lake County gold right there, baby. That's a gorgeous fish. Look at that. I love this, their golden color on these fish up here. 17, 18 inches. That's gonna be delicious table fare. We're gonna put him in the live well, but that is what you come up here for. That is such a nice fish on a late June morning while I was in the boat. It doesn't get much better. Let's get this one in the live well. All right, we got another bobber down here. I'm just letting him take it a little bit. Grant just put that other one in the boat. Not two minutes later here, we got another bobber down. We'll see here. There he is. Hopefully the right flavor. Oh yeah, nice walleye. Good eater walleye there. Oh, flip him in. 
all spunky. Beautiful Lake County walleye. Golden color. He's all charged up. Hooked him right through there with the jig. We kind of switched to a little slip bobber presentation from jigs. We have a really nice rock spine that comes out right now and the wind's blowing right over the top of this thing perfect. Comes kind of up to like seven, eight feet at the top of it. So we're putting our bobbers right around there and we're just letting them float over the top of this with the wind. And we, that's two bites within just a couple minutes. So hopefully we'll get a few more fish on this style of fishing here. Little rock spine, slip bobber walleyes in Lake County. Beautiful. Man, we're getting a nice drift over this rock pile this right is now. Just move spots. And and set up good. Mm -hmm. There we go, Grant. Bobber down? Right away. <laughs> we called right away. it. I'm gonna let him eat it for just a second here. He took it down good though. There he is. Nice. Right behind the boat. First nice. drift right away. Nice walleye, Grant. Very nice walleye. Just got walleye. a flash of him here. Very nice walleye. Oh, right at the boat. <laughs> that's a nice 16. Yeah, hoist them on in here. That's a very nice fish. There we go. Boom. It's getting a little big to be boat flipping. I, I, I didn't think it was that big. That's 16, that's 17. 17, 17 yeah. and a half, maybe 18 all day. But just chunky and yeah, dark in color. They're thick in here. That's what I love about northern Minnesota and especially Lake County is like a lot of bog stained lakes up here, which means you're going to have a good bite all throughout the day, which is very beneficial. But also, like the walleyes are just drop dead gorgeous. They like, are. Look at that. Golden beauties. Truly, like backwoods, yep. northern Minnesota walleyes. Yep, absolutely. Nice. Slip bobbers. They're doing the trick right now with they this are. wind. Wind picked up. That's Beautiful. slip bobber time, right? Right. Heck yeah. yeah, man. I love it. That's a nice fish. Right on. Bobber down. Bobber down. There it is. Beautiful. Yeah, it feels like another good fish. Oh. It's such a constant theme that we're developing here in terms of spots. Yeah, this fish is staying down. Yeah, it's a nice walleye. Oh. In terms of, look at that. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful northern Minnesota gold. That is awesome. Just quality size here like so many fish except for that you know right away that first smaller one but like every single fish like 17 17 and a half like solid stocky fish just gorgeous walleyes just perfect for like if you want to come up here and get some fish for a shore lunch let's get this guy in the live well real quick but every spot it's such a consistent theme right now as you can see behind us there's another one of these white buoys. And again, these white buoys are marking dangerous rocks. But that also means that there's going to be walleyes there. There's a big rock pile there. They hold fish. And with this wind kind of coming in here, just letting slip bobbers drift back up onto those rocks, and a walleye is going to eat it. So, I mean, that's kind of three different spots now, all with a white buoy on it, and you catch a fish. So that's what's nice about this lake here at Birch Lake is that there's no secret spots, right? Like all the spots, you can kind of look at it, are clearly marked for you. Just find the white buoys. You're going to find rock piles. You're going to find walleyes. That's another fish in the boat. you got to love it. Nice. Your oh, bobber's down too. Uh oh. <laughs> we got double trouble. Yes. <laughs> yes. Double. <laughs> That's double trouble, baby. Look at this walleye. Woo -hoo -wee. This one Look feels at like that. a good one too. Got some weight. That's a gorgeous walleye. I'm excited to see what Joe has here too. Gorgeous walleye, man. How awesome is that? And the best part of this is it's getting towards like midday, like 10, 11 o'clock. We have high sun. Look at that. Ooh, one. that's a big, that's another big fish, man. That's another big fish. Look at Beauty. that. Double trouble up here in Lake County, catching walleyes on slip bobbers and leeches. That doesn't get any more fun. Oh, those are beauties. Eh? That is so cool. 
And that's why we chose this lake too, because like it's just a good consistent bite all day long with this stained water in here. Like you can catch these fish from sun up to sundown and the, there's just no lull really. Like it's it's midday right now and we're catching walleyes like this in the shallows with a slip bobber and a leech. Like it doesn't get much better. No, that's, they're beautiful Let's get fish. these guys in the live well. Boom, into the well they go. That's awesome. And the fun part about up here in Lake County, like this isn't the only lake to come out here and catch walleyes. You know, we chose this just because again, a good all day consistent bite, but there's a lot of other water up here. Like you spend a lot of time up here, like yep. a couple of lakes just north of here that are very good too. Absolutely. Farm yeah. and white iron. Farm, white iron, garden, yep. There's a lot of lakes in Lake County that have fabulous, fabulous walleye fishing all throughout the summer, spring, summer, fall even. But right yep. now is just a magical time because you get walleyes like that on slip bobber and a, a little jig and a leech. It's a fun time, so beautiful. Yeah, Let's get work. back out there. I love that thump of a walleye hitting a, a jig and leech. That's a nice fish. Look at that. <laughs> right there, baby. Right there, and that is an awesome way to end our day on Birch Lake. And it hasn't even been a full day. It's been more like a half day, but we have caught tons and tons of walleyes of just awesome caliber. Like no big fish, but like, and they're in here. Like there's big fish in here, but just the average size, 15, 16, 17s. If you're looking for a, a lake to come and get some shore launch or bring some kids and have some awesome action, like Birch Lake here is a great, great location. Like 7,000 acres of water to explore. Like we barely touched even if a fifth of a lake today. Like there's so much water out there, so much structure and so many walleyes. Thank you guys for tuning in. We'll catch you next time.